Oh, welcome back my gardening friends. Well, my friends from Fitville have sent me a couple of pairs of uh, winter shoes. We're going to be looking at the winter clogs uh, shortly. It's getting towards winter. We've had a frost again. I've been out gritting. So, before we venture out into the garden, let's have a look at these uh, winter clogs. They do come uh, well packaged. And as you can see there, comfort technology, arch and heel support, recovery power. I have tried these on and they're really comfortable and uh, very warm compared uh, to uh, my old ones. And uh, here we are, while we are special, they are wide toe box, lightweight with protection, stable and shock absorbing. Cloud like comfort, slip resistance, and versatile with extra right in there if you wish to have a look at those. And this company specializes in width and comfort. Now I have one foot larger than the other, and if I forget and I use my right foot as uh, to try a shoe on, it'll fit lovely. But when I put my left foot shoe on when I get home or boot whatever I buy it's always a little bit tight around the toes so uh, if you suffer from wider feet bunions uh, you're a diabetic this is uh, what they specialize in and I found these uh, really comfortable different widths and uh, Fitville is a cutting-edge company pursuing in human foot health and Fitville shoes are helpful and have a selection of shoes and boots to help people in their daily life to prevent sprained ankles and knee injuries. And we know the wrong shoes, wrong boots can cause us a little bit of discomfort. And as always, why not just check out the links below for these shoes and their all their products and uh, they give us as a generous uh, some generous discount code so if you're a new user to Fitville uh, you can get a 35% on your new order and 30% uh, after that and watch out for the special offers but you make that decision right let's get these on and have a little wander around our garden and check out the garden makeover I think Mrs Kale want to get rid of my slippers now like me you before you go out you just really want to uh, just slip those feet in pull up the supports at the back and uh, off we go I think Scarlett would like uh, some nice new poor shoes I'm not going to wander too far down because I don't want to get these dirty until we get the garden makeover. We've been concentrating on the pond. This is a bit of a blog for myself as well. Mrs K has dressed it a little bit. And uh, it's worked out really nice considering what it used to look like. There'll be the playlist at the end on the garden makeover. So you can uh, see uh, what we've uh, been up to and the changes that uh, we've been making. Uh, the next little, next little project is the area for the log cabin. The summer house that was in the corner, which was 8 by 8 has now been dismantled in the shed, ready to be transported to my son's. The base is already down for him to put it up, and then I've been spending quite a bit of time getting this uh, all sorted and ready for the concrete next week. I've got a, a week off to get the concrete down. We're gonna have delivery from the log cabin people. We've had a little bit of extra discount from them, so I will be giving them a mention. Need to get all this area cleared now of uh, debris so that we can get uh, the log cabin in because it does come in small pieces and we have to uh, put it all together and, uh, we've put those little corner bits in to help support like I said before should I have put those over the top like this but it doesn't matter I think
think it looks good and like I've said before, Mrs K likes it. Do you approve Skylar? Of course, as he sniffs the new shoes. The netting is just draped over at the moment. We'll cut it and bury it once we're sorted. And then there's the uprights to the uh, log stepping stones, which will eventually contour around uh, the log cabin uh, towards the left-hand side of the gate, retaining uh, the chippings. All these have been washed that were scattered all over while we were, it was a temporary measure. Just give them a wash, but we'll give them a pressure wash uh, later on just to clean them up a bit more. And that's Flamingo, lovely looking stone when it's clean. And the last few bits of grass offcuts are just protecting the soil from Skylar digging it all up. I think that'll uh, work uh, really well. As he finds something else to eat, we tried to make it Skylar proof, we didn't want him leaving pour marks in the concrete. We used some of the equipment uh, from the allotment. I'll be reviewing uh, Fitville's uh, winter boots up at the allotment when we do our next uh, update. And uh, the discount code for the 35% is just for November 23. But uh, why not uh, take a look since I've been walking around this very cold morning. My feet have warmed up nicely. Uh, I am very impressed. They won't stay that colour for long, but the comfort and the warmth will help me such a lot with my funny feet. I'll definitely be wearing those more often, and as you can see there, the bottom of the shoes give uh, uh, you plenty of grip on whatever surface uh, you're walking on. And as always, I'll give you an update on these shoes and the boots and there'll be a playlist uh, eventually once we've uh, done a few more videos if you've liked the content please give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down for the interaction definitely leave me a comment if you've used fitville before why not uh, leave me a comment how you found them honest personal views are welcome and why not consider subscribing to see what mad cat things I get up to. Happy gardening to you all. Till next time, my friends. Bye for now. Don't forget, check out the links in the description below.